Okay. All right, so here's an SAT math trick for you. So this problem here, it's not too difficult, and you can solve it in a couple different ways. But the fastest way to solve this, in my opinion, would be to say if 3R equals 18, and I'm asked what the value of 6R plus 3 is, a mistake, in my opinion, would be go through and solve for R. Okay, solving for R is going to take you a lot longer than if you were to say if 3R equals 18, I know that 3R times 2 gives me 6R, so I take 18 times 2, that's going to give me 36. 36 plus 3, that equals 39. Okay, notice how much faster that is than if I was to divide each side by 3 here, and then get 18 over 3 equals 6, then plus plug 6 in for R, do 6 times 6, and then add 3. Notice how many more steps that is versus if I just recognize that if 3R equals 18, then 6R has to equal double 18, since 3R times 2 is 6R. 18 times 2 is 36, 36 plus 3, that must be 39, okay? So just recognize how many less steps it is if I just recognize 3R, and now I'm asked about 6R. Well, if 3R is 18, I double 18. That gives me 36. 36 plus 3, that's 39. Okay, that takes a lot, lot less time than if you divide each side by 3 and solve for R and then plug R in. Okay, so that's one tip you can use to save time on the SAT math section.